the best. We do love a glass bottle of Coke. Um, right, I'll start off. Right, <clears throat> basically, um, evening, Sam. Um, you all know what's been going on. You you guys know the full situation that's been happening. Um, basically, I was at work today and I am getting harassment calls while I'm at work now um, and stuff. So I have gone and taken a route. Um, oh, go away, Angie. Mm, blocked. Right. I have gone and taken another route because obviously um, this is getting to a really bad point now. Um, I have spoken to my mum on the phone today. She said, like, she's obviously quite hurt, the fact that her story is being used against me um, and stuff. Um, I'm not concerned, by the way, that an exposure is getting put on me tonight because... I've got nothing to hide. I've told you guys my um I Miss Debs, it's already been done. That's what I'm kind of <laughs> that's what I'm alluding to, but yeah, I'm not scared about there's only two reasons why I'm concerned um about this exposure tonight. Um oh <laughs> Rickster. Oh I shouldn't have said his name, fuck. Um a certain person. Hey. Um so I have, um, what was I going to say? Have obviously been told to come off TikTok, which I'm going to have to do. Um, that's why I'm live, I'm telling you. Um, I, I don't know how long for. I just know that I have got an appointment tomorrow. Um, I have been told, um, Guys, it's not forever. I might come back. This is not a forever thing, but this needs to be dealt with. Um, I shouldn't be at work and I shouldn't be getting called a fat see you next Tuesday. Like I had a work friend listening to the full conversation told that I'm going to get destroyed and stuff like this. Like like that's that's what happened to me while I was at work. And it's not fair. I've I am. Um, I've spoken to my my phone company. My phone number is a way to get changed. Um, so I am doing everything right to stop this. I was called today by them asking what I want out of this. I want nothing out of this. I want it to stop. That's it. And now for me to get this to stop, I have to go down a route that I really didn't want to have to go down. Um, and that's the only way it's going to stop. I... I'm going to have slander about me being a predator, which is not even fucking true. That is what they're going to paint on me tonight. Um, they're going to put my old Discord where people sat and had discussions on their trauma, like private conversations. I tried my best to create a safe space for people that I used to be friends with um to be able to have conversations and that's what they can leak whatever on that discord right i bitched about miss red i bitched about angie i bitched about a lot of creators on the app do you know what my discord used to be a place where we would just sit and watch tiktok lives and we'd have a gossip like every tiktok um whatsapp group literally sam so that's um i appreciate that guys honestly i do um I have to do what's right for now. Um, I am going to be screen recording, obviously, that whole live because if any slander that's not true is going to be getting said, that's obviously evidence. Um, so, yeah, I have to do what I have to do. I have a son. I have a family. This shit has got too far. You know what I mean? Like, it's gone too far now. Um... I, I don't want to say the names, guys, but it's, you know, you know, it's, but I've removed all my videos around them. Um, I'm not going to speak their name. I've been advised not to speak their names either. Um, but yeah, I know, look, I'm going to say this. I know a lot of you, not that you don't care. That sounds weird saying that. I don't mean it like that because I'm not saying these are horrible people. I do find it personally funny that he thinks that people care enough about me as a person on this app like they don't 
you know what I mean? They generally don't. Like, I'm just someone that comes live and does, you know... Do you know what I mean? Like, okay, Angie and I know that Pearl, I think, was in here. She just followed me. Do you know what I mean? I've been speaking about them, so they're going to speak about me and have an issue with me. Um, <laughs> um, I will. I will. I'll be. Um, I've. I've got. I've got something to get the proper full on screen recordings. Um, don't worry. I've. I've made sure of it. I've got. I've got something to do it that's like literally got full storage. Um, and I've not used it. Um, but yeah. But this is TikTok, guys. And do you know what? I can. I don't need to sit on this app. And hey Diane, I don't need to sit on this app. Um, I don't need to sit in this app and show the type of people they are. I think we can all admit that they're doing that themselves. They're doing that themselves. They're showing the type of people that they are. And um, I'm fine, I'm fine. Um, but yes, as I said, this exposure, I don't, I'm not actually concerned. The only thing that I'm expo like concerned about is again, my mom being brought up, um, and also like conversations that were in my discord where people spoke about like stuff about them, their personal life. I think it's really disgusting. I know the individual that's done this, that is, um, giving them my Discord chat where there's conversations about people talking about children, talking about their trauma. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, this was a Discord, like, fair enough, where we spoke about things, but we also had conversations about ourselves. And sometimes those conversations got deep, and it makes me sick that I hoped that I put a place there for people to be able to have that conversation and someone's now away going yeah I know who it is I know who it is um I know who's done that um but yeah but anyway guys um I'm, I'm probably gonna go ahead um but yeah I don't know how long I'll be off for um no, it's not. It's not. It's not. Um, ten o'clock. This is what I'm saying. I'm really not like I'm not scared because they're gonna tell complete other bullshit. The stuff that they can't show on the app is going to be bullshit. They might even fucking no. It, it's 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 someone that start starts with an L. Yeah, I'm fine, miss. I don't. I will. I am. That's what I'm doing. Um, everything. Don't worry. Um, I did also get that call that I got. This is the thing. I was at work and I had my phone charging in a separate area and luckily my friend came with me. Do you know what I mean? So I have got um, witnesses um, and L. Yeah, if anyone that knows me were when I used to be friends with certain people on this app, they'll know an L. They're in in amongst that group. Um, guess it's people. <laughs> I just farted, I need to shower now. Um, yeah, there you go, red, red wine. Yeah, that's who's, who's um, now I'm not gonna lie, she wasn't in my Discord for very long. So I don't know how much she's gonna really be able to reveal. But as I said, I don't care um, about anything that I've personally said. I've not said like, do you know what I mean? Like anything that I haven't said on this app, like I literally, my whole platform is discussing and gossiping about creators. So I'm not really fussed on that side of it. But as I said, it's more the sensitive stuff. Um, I'd like to hope they wouldn't do that. I'd hope that they're not that vile, but I, I thought that and then they brought up my mum. So, you know, um, and also I'm not a man hair. Just want to put it out there. Definitely not a man hair. <laughs> But yeah. But guys, follow this account because this is going to be my account that I'm going to be doing my FYP on. Um, I don't know how long I said I'll be off for. I'm definitely going to be this whole weekend. Um, 
yeah this is just the type of people unfortunately like because the thing is it's not against the law to show anything other than whatsapp so if i went live and showed whatsapp i could get effed over for that if they went live and showed yeah yeah jag if i went live and shown do you know what i mean anything and they or they did that's what i mean right so i the person that they're trying to make me out as a predator against this is what makes me laugh is actually someone i've only ever spoken to through whatsapp um or on a tiktok live um so the only way that they can prove that, that this stuff is true which is it's not um would be through um showing whatsapp messages so yeah so bear that in mind guys listen to them and can we also remember what some of these people are like known for like what their whole the the whole thing of them on this app is like do, do you know what i mean like especially the the man do you know what his whole platform was it maybe isn't as bad as that now but it, it was um so definitely not miss devs thank you so much thank you so much for that thank you charlie but yeah there's no oh i will be do you know what i went into work i should you know i went into work today and i was like guys guess what i'm being exposed <laughs> and they actually laughed their fucking ass off they were like what they were like that's iconic that is like that's like housewives of beverly hills vibes right there <laughs> thank you so much palestine what guess what ring ring six feet under raving with the worms what oh god that's gonna get removed what the fuck no that's not okay let's not do that um oh god yeah it will definitely be oh <laughs> you, you you muted as i um as i muted there <laughs> um but anyway guys go enjoy your weekend um you know let's uh, i'm good serena thank you um you know go and enjoy me getting exposed um you know and i'm and i'm sorry if any is watch this and change your opinion on me and whatever i i can't do you know what i mean i i i can only say what i can i can't sit on here because it's do you know what it's hard to do is prove that something's a lie when you haven't done it do you know what i mean like i don't have whatsapp messages with dimitri from like the summertime anymore um like i don't have them available to show my full conversation with him well baza exactly but you know um i think also we all know who dimitri rodriguez is i think we all know everything about him on this app as well so yeah it is interesting i've heard all now oh god this is it i don't i don't really care about anyone's opinions other than the people that like i'm friends with and knows me in real life do you know what i mean and when i sat and told the people that are around me i told my husband and everything they all laughed that like every single one of them laughed because they knew that everything that they were trying to say is a complete nerd bullshit I, when I phoned my mum about this, like, the first thing she said is, that's disgusting, you know, using, but she also laughed. She was like, remember that the, everyone's going to see them while they're trying to expose you. Like, everyone's going to see them while they're doing this. And I put my video up showing just a snippet of what they said last night. And I had more love than any hate i didn't i think i got one hate in my comments so yeah i'm aware uh, sorry i can't help it it's just it's <laughs> i i have really like that's my like you know thing it's because i'm being i know i know it's because um i'm being weedy of what i'm saying obviously i've got to be careful what i say if there'd been SS private conversation, then show us who, are, who they are. Well, I mean, this is a thing, Baza. My conversation was from, like, 
um, no. My conversation was from the summer with this person that they're trying to say that I uh, I didn't even know this person whenever they were in a hospital. So I don't get that either. Honestly, you can imagine me sitting there listening to the stuff they're saying. Like, I'm being exposed my Discord, okay? And then they're saying I'm being exposed for escaping Facebook. I don't know what that means. Like, what does me escaping Facebook? Like, I've got my same Facebook that I've had for years. So I, it's honestly, the stuff they say. Oh, Lucy, trust me. I, I can believe that. Lucy, honestly. Oh, is, is there been comments like that? I've not seen any. If anybody says anything like that. No one has ever asked me. Oh, I know. I wonder who that was for. And all I'm going to say is I don't believe anything that that person comes out of their mouth when they've, they've said the stuff about me. Do you know what I mean? Thank you. Yeah. I agree with that one. I actually go need to go and listen to your new song. I agree with that as well. Here for the tea. Um, I, Lucy, I've had this on and off now since September. And tr trust me when I say this, never become friends with people on this app. One person I spoke to on the phone last night and I had a really good phone call with a certain person on this app. I'm not going to say, sorry, um, I'm not going to say who they are, but I had a really good phone call with someone that's on this app. And do you know what they said to me is, do not make friends on this app. And I well and truly, I'm going to stick to that, to my guns, right? There's people on this app that I speak to, but I'm never going to make friends with a creator like that again. Um, do you know what I mean? Like, um, especially people who are problematic, things like that. Like, I am going to keep myself guarded as much as possible. I'm staying away from group chats. That's for definite as well. Um, I, it's, it's honestly, it, it's, it is, it is, a. Uh, it's a thing of mine of touching and itching my scalp. I can't help it. Um, yeah. And I, I know that. Oh God, Lily, I'm an idiot. I've made so, how have I kept, like me and Lily have known each other since I've been on this app, right? And I have made mistakes after mistakes after mistakes, right? I have made, I've gone with friendship groups where there's group chats and there's been massive falling outs. Trust me, I have made the biggest mistakes on this app. And the fact that I can't seem to fucking learn is what's worrying because it's just my personality. I have got a bit of an addictive personality um, and I... I literally know that TikTok is a little bit of an addiction of mine. Um, I'm aware of it and I need to listen to, you know, my husband. He is going to be, you know, fucking sticking by me and helping me through, you know, making sure that I don't go live. That is one thing. He said, you're going live tonight and that is it. Do you know what I mean? Like, until everything is sorted, until, like, none of this is happening. Like, he has no issues with me going live. But when this shit is happening, when I'm in my workplace, like, and that kind of stuff is happening, that's when it's a different level. It's no longer drama on an app. Um, it goes different. And that's why... Yeah. Exactly. Exactly here for the tea. I agree. Um, but anything, I will say this. Anything that is in my Discord... Yeah, I know she does. She does know where to work. And vice versa. Do you know what I mean? But I'm not going to do anything because I'm not that shitty person. I'm going down. I've tried to do the mature route, but I made a video saying that I'm not going to speak about them again. Thank you. But then I was being blackmailed. Um, 
you know so like it could have ended that moment i made that video saying i'm not going to speak about them again that's when it could have ended but instead they needed to then start blackmailing me um so that's why i've decided um to go down the other route instead like i've done everything it's it's easy to say that though to leave them but they're not like i mean I've, as i said um i'm definitely going to be my number has been is on in the process of changing because it does take a little bit of time um that's not actually what happened louise <laughs> um if it is louise is this louise louise is this you i thought i swear i blocked you don't don't mute uh don't block yet because i want to say this louise um if it is you right i did that video and i made another video about this because i wanted to prove the fact that me and him were having conversations off the app that in my knowledge she didn't know about like he told me that she wouldn't be happy of me and him speaking still and me and him were still speaking um so didn't she's done it already delaney this is the thing it's already happened that's why i didn't want him to get involved with her it's nothing to do with anything other than the fact that she sat on an app and made it out that he was this crazy stalker do you know what i mean that was the issue no not you louise um, do you know what I mean? Like, she made it out that he was going to turn up to his to her house, and now, now I do genuinely believe that was all fake. Like, full on believe that that was all set up. Um. Yeah. Sorry, one second. I mean, do you remember the bag situation? I was sitting there going, oh my God, am I actually, am I actually sitting here pretending that this is all real? <laughs> I knew it was fake. <laughs> oh, it was so obvious. The acting, oh my God, the fucking acting. Could I just say he's never confirmed to me um, that it was. Um, I was just talking about how I have been to the popos um, about everything, about everything that's been going on. And I had a phone call today um, while I was at work. But yeah, um, what's I saying? Yeah, I, I can't believe that like some people's action is too panto. Um, but yeah, remember people's history right i've not got a clean slate i'll say it do you know what i mean i've sat on this app i've had drama galore there was moments when i did relish on it because you know i got a little bit hyped up the views were there and i was like Woo, let's go but i actually can't be asked with it i'm 36 years old and when i do that there's two nights in a row this week that i've barely slept because i'm sorry um oh bev 100 percent. and you know what that was that was the kryptonite um he didn't like the fact that i mentioned that i felt that she was telling the truth i, I called it month like a month ago two, a month and a half ago that a hundred percent EQ was telling the truth on that one that how much she was manipulated to the core I don't believe I don't think they went together like that and by the way I never said I was love bombed never said I was love bombed I said I was manipulated and I was manipulated to almost like create an army I just want to put it out there because I feel like that's been twisted recently as well I never ever said that he love bombed me. I was the one that was the bad person. I, I'm not blaming him for what I thought and how I felt. What I'm blaming him for was 
he gave me that sense of I no 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 god no 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 he gave me that sense of we're good friends friends till the end you know blah 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 um and all of that while making a fucking mug of me constantly um do you know what i mean and that's the thing like you know people think that i'm saying he's making a mug of me because he went with talia no he's making a mug of me because he went with talia while telling us other stuff in the background you know you can imagine imagine one of your friends is sitting telling you um she's a psycho she's turning up to my hometown and all of this shit shit like guys i'm getting like he was he was sending us in the group chat voice notes from other women right like saying sual things to him so we thought that they were totally yeah we got totally torn apart you should i was messages <laughs> no i'm not that person um but yeah he he totally told us that he wanted to meet another person. He was going to go and see Amy Winehouse or another person. Yeah, I wonder who that's for, Miss Baguette. I was wondering that as well. No, right. So again, this is what people are misunderstanding. Um, didn't he go with... I'm not sure. I don't know if that's true or not. I'm not going to lie. No, Amy Winehouse in cinema, you know her film. <laughs> Delaney, you're cheeky. Um, yeah, so, you know, you can imagine we're sitting there and it's not, it's not the fact that we were sitting there saying that, like, it's not the fact that I'm sitting there going, how dare he get with Talia, blah, 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 like, in that way, because of me, it was more the fact that, you know, one, he's telling us she's a psycho, three out of ten, and all of this shit, do you know what I mean? Like, that, I d what, what did you, do? friends till the end, <laughs> we'll never fall out again, I smell drama, <laughs> I always drama on TikTok. Um, but yeah, I'm waiting. I'm getting exposed tonight, Michelle. Wait for it. And Michelle, say it to me, because you can say it. I never got to hear you say it yesterday. Tell me. I know you're going to tell me. I told you so. And I regret that moment. Michelle told me. She's going to be like, don't out me. When, when them two were arguing on a live right <laughs> um me when me <laughs> when them two were arguing in the live and i kind of got caught in it michelle came in my box and says just get that mod badge away don't be as mod do you know what I mean? Do your own thing and blah 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 and I'm like fuck I should have listened do you know what I mean? And he didn't like that right it's funny Michelle called him out right and said the type of person he is and he did not like that he didn't like that someone's seen what he is that's what he didn't like guys he wanted me to make a video to apologize right he wanted me to make a video apologizing for saying he manipulated me because he didn't want people thinking that because he doesn't want people to think i actually i shit you not I've had three messages from people who have also been manipulated by him. And that's not a that's not me being dramatic. People that have said that he's like manipulated down for the gifting side of it, um, flirting and things like this, like so you know, it's nice to know I wasn't alone. <clears throat> he tried it with you on Instagram. I know, I know, trust me, I d um, <sighs> yeah, Danny B, you know, um, sorry, my dog's whining, but anyway, guys, no, and to be honest, it's the fact I did work it out. I did work it out. 
um, like, but I didn't really work it out. I had spoken to Craig because me and him had a conversation. I told him the situation for me in my head. What had basically happened was um, I went to a mental a, a mental health doctor because I was not in a really good place and I've been able to have that conversation with them and you know I've looked into getting counselling and things like that and one of the things I wanted to do was obviously have a conversation with him tell him 100% where I'm at so he can obviously support me and make him understand things so when I spoke to him I told him everything I showed him a whole conversation and he's like what the fuck why is he saying shit like that to you why like do you know what I mean? He's like, this is dodge. Like, the fact that he's sitting in group chats and all of this shit just saying, like, really just, yeah. It's fucking hard to explain. And then and then I went and, you know, almost, like, had that conversation with my mum, almost like a second opinion. And she was just like, this is, like, red flags galore. So I did end up, that was, like fucking hell I can't even think when that was now but he yeah um he barely spoke to us he was just around to like get him to like his content and things like that but like I did walk away plenty of times I tried I really did try but he was he'd be like Courtney man like I love you he actually sung on one of his voice notes, these words are mine. I love you, I love you, I love you. Like at the beginning of his voice note. Um, I shit you not, only, you know when I started doing my Unicorn FYP and when I fell out with EQ, he was like, what you need to do now is do a live like platform and how positive me and, t me and T are and, and all of this shit, like show that I am six foot two and, like he sent me a picture of his passport to prove his age and he said he was going to get a tape measure to like do you know what I mean um yeah like he would say like little things like that to me um and do you know T said yeah that it's pathetic it's an app why just turn it off you have a yeah no I, I get that Frida um I can't, Jenny, because it's against the law and I'm not that person. Yeah. There's a lot more. Trust me, there's a lot more that I can't say. Um, I really can't say. Trust me, I'm biting my fucking tongue. But, um, yeah. That's all I can say because at the end of the day, what I've said can only affect me and I'm not going to sit on this app and... Yes, yes. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. No, because this things, other things affect other people. They don't just affect me. S send them to me. <laughs> Miss Baguette. <laughs> oh, honestly. Anyway, before I go... um. No, but I don't want other people to be affected. The shit that I've gone through this fucking few days, I don't want anyone else to be going through that. Um, yes, I married and that was all on me. I don't blame Rick for that. Can I just say, by the way, Rick did know, um, 100% knew, because I'd literally made a statement to him and told him. Um, and I said to him... Uh, like a different time or whatever I can't remember what I said so he knew by the way he's saying that he didn't know um but no but what I was gonna say is before I go my main thing is oh my god look the judge at CLA is like what the fuck but that's what he wants right right I'm going to ask you in the chat, right? Be honest, right? What do you all know R for? Yes, he went to CLA's. Oh my God. Luke being there is fucking hilarious. Hey. 
Hey, Pinky. <laughs> Slimy. <laughs> no, Luke went to CLA's. <gasps> yeah. Oh, that's something I can show, by the way, because I've that's my own screen. Um, I've got a voice note, by the way, for not that Angie's probably watching, but Angie, I've got a voice note that I can play you where I tell him that it was um it was wrong for him to uh do that picture, by the way. Um I've literally got a voice note of me saying it in the group chat that I didn't agree with him dressing up as that person and it was um it was wrong for him to do that. So do we rem do we know him as a good person? I I mean I'm not gonna lie, but not really. <laughs> the hate I got for being around him, and do you know what he used to say to me? So I used to say to him, the hate I get for being associated with you and being your mod and stuff. He literally would say, me too. I get hate for being associated with you. <laughs> I shit you not. <laughs> yeah. And we all know what she's known for, right? <laughs> There's only one person. We don't know her for what she's wanting to be claimed to be known for. Oh yeah, thank you for reminding me. God, this is turning into a bitch session, isn't it? Oh, Chelsea, same. Oh, Chelsea, I actually need to tell you this because you are involved in this. Um, they are, Louise has given them our Discord chat I know I need to go you know you, you guys are just thinking me um probably not Serena um yeah so Louise oh mama ghoul you're here as well yeah Louise remember her she's um she's given him our discord messages which is weird meaning that she must have like saved them and kept them for this long because that was back in September. Like our Discord conversations was back in September. Yeah. Oh, so many snakes. I, that's Chelsea Chelsea this is exactly what I've said right this is my big concern about this whole situation is the fact that I thought I created a safe space right even though we sat and had conversations and all of that about creators we also had discussions on real things um sh we had conversations that was really fucking personal um Chelsea, what I would recommend to do is watch his live tonight because that's what he's supposedly going to be showing. I am honestly, I am so sorry that anyone else is getting dragged into this. I am so fucking sorry because this is the last thing i wanted right and this will be no more will that to ever they'll never be mentioned on my fyp yeah i will message you charles i'll message i'll message you um looper they are already involved i agree lady in black they're already involved this is why i'm being very weedy i say 
yeah, no, Michelle, trust me. I know. I know, Chelsea. But the thing is, Chelsea, I don't think you were in my Discord when she was. Because she wasn't in there a long time. I've got the first one still. Louise was never in the sec the second one. I've still got my first one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Louise wasn't in the private part of it. Remember, we had a private part. Louise wasn't in that. Yeah, but I don't... Chelsea, I, I remember right. I think you joined after Louise. Wait, what? That's Suzanne in the chat. Have you left... Sorry, what? Have you left his team alone or have any walked with you? I don't get what that means. Can we mute that Suzanne? I don't know what she means. I'm very confused. This Sim girl one, she is a piece of work. Honestly, she's probably one of... Honestly, that person has no fucking empathy in her heart at all. Like, she is probably one of the most vilest people that I've ever known in my life. Oh! Oh, God. Okay, sorry. Oh, yes. Sorry, can we unmute Suzanne? Sorry, I was really confused. Yes. Um, In the time that I've been around... Three other mods are no longer there. Three other mods are no longer there. I'm not saying names. I'm not saying anything because I'm so sorry. <laughs> I got really confused. I'm. It, it was big words, guys. Yeah. Sorry, Suzanne big words and all you know that I just didn't get I'm really not that intelligent <laughs> um oh god I'll block them anyone it's to do with the cult will be getting blocked wait is Diana in here No, that was my other account, Miss Begat. That was my other account because, um, you know, when I was having my meltdown. Not my finest moment. That was definitely, like, have you ever seen the Blair Witch product Project? You know, the woman's, like, got her fucking nostrils out and the fucking tears. Oh, that was disgusting. And I sat, listened to Alex's live and you can hear Angie playing a video when I'm fucking crying my eyes out. Fucking hell, I'm pathetic. Hey, Ali. Yeah. It was a different account. Yeah. I actually thought it was really funny when I was asking Comment Cafe to follow me so that I can go live. <laughs> Someone wrote... I'll follow you, but if you start crying, I'm unfollowing you. <laughs> um, yeah, what I'll do, I'll, I'll follow you back and I'll message you, okay? Because I don't really want to say names on that, like, on here. That was me! <laughs> I was actually creased. I was like, oh my god. Um... I'm actually really impressed the fact we did it, guys. I, I mean, it took a day, but we did it. Um, <laughs> I'm not, Serena. Know what? I'm going to be... I'm going to be able to walk out my head held high. Um, do you know what I mean? I think... I, I think... Do you know what it is, right? The way I see it is, I do believe that the people that are going to actually listen and believe anything that they say are the type of people that are like, Oh, follower, what do we do next? Do you know what I mean? Like, and do I want that, people? Oh, Mama Ghoul, I, I, I know. And I'm so sorry because, like, obviously I've not really spoken to you and Chelsea that much recently, but I'm fucking... 
Me too. Especially when cats say hello. It gives me happy tears. When I see cats going, hello. Oh my God, it just makes me happy. I get happy tears. And I saw a dog today and it actually put a smile on me because it was one of those dogs that looked like it was smiling. And I was like, yeah. It's been really nice. And I am so sorry that me doing something stupid has brought other people into this. I'd like to think, with all honesty, that I need to go and look and see when she was part of it because I don't think she was in it for long, um, to be fair. But yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Definitely, Michelle, do that. We all just need to, like, we've all tried to walk away from drama and stuff like that. I mean, obviously, I know that, look, I know that I'm going to be involved in drama, right? Hey, Hayley. Um, uh, hi, Angel Cakes. I know that I'm going to be involved in drama when I do my lives, right? But I think what people don't understand is there's a difference with getting phone calls while you're at work people bringing up stuff like that like when me and angie argue like it doesn't really hurt me that much it doesn't feel that personal but this is like a different level um do you know what i mean it's a different conversation but yeah i can't wait for my number to actually change that it's gonna be amazing um yes i got my live back um hey laws Is MT part of the cult? No, I wouldn't say MT's part of the cult. Thank you, Laws. I had a, we had a really good conversation with MT that day in the box, so no, I wouldn't say. It's not your fault, there's problems with you, and that's fine, but not others that aren't. Exactly, Chelsea, I know. Also, I also want to say something, because this really... In the time that I'm crying my eyes out, I couldn't help but chuckle in this moment. So they brought up the fact that... Now, the way they painted it is like, yeah, she had a crush. Okay, I didn't have a crush. I literally had a laugh and a giggle that I thought, you guys are going to judge me. And please do not judge me. But I said that certain boring Brett was good looking. Like, can people know the difference between saying someone's good looking and having a crush? I also said Karma Kaz is good looking. <laughs> um, <laughs> don't judge me. Um, <laughs> getting messages now. Um, don't. I'm sorry. Right, but Karma Kaz. Yeah. So I said that I think Karma Kaz. I shit you not. I was on the phone about this to that person that starts with an R and I said that Karma Kaz is hot and all of this shit I was he he left the phone call that is I swear to god if anyone sat and sometimes I did it to wind him up see if you sat in his in his group see if you sat in his group chat and talked about other people being hot fuck and all the jealousy would honestly it was fucking brilliant he would honestly he wouldn't speak he would go in a huff um yeah but yeah so but and i do not mean oh oh laz you might have to spill the tea um no i don't think he did danny B um yeah so i i he said that he said another person <laughs> he said another person and i'm not dissing this person i'm not saying that this person is not good looking he's just not my type i have never ever ever said that dg is good looking i've never ever ever said that right again i'm not insulting him because he's not my type i think dg's funny but in no way have I ever said that I am attracted to DG. I've never... No, honestly, guys, I swear to God, 
the only people on this app that I've ever said was Brett, ooh, now. Um, I've never said that also. Um, I've ne- Trust me, my opinion has changed to Brett. Um, Karma Kaz, how much he hates me. Um, I think he's good looking and I'll stand by that. Okay, Karma Kaz is hot, right? Um, but that doesn't mean I have a crush. I think someone's good looking, right? It's I'm not saying they're celebrities again. I'm not saying that. But I think there's a difference when you are looking at someone over a phone and you think they're good looking. That is how deranged it is, right? Um, I am married. I'm still married. <laughs> Guys. Um... Yeah, Jodie, basically, Louise is um, passed on our Discord group chat um, onto R. Um, and, you know, conversations that happened in there were not things that want we want to be thingied. And again, it's not Diadro. No, not Diadro. Ew. So yeah, um, and I do, I do honestly, I cannot apologize enough. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Miss Forget, you, what are you like? <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, Jody, I know. Look, me and you don't see eye to eye. Me and you have fallen out, like we're not friends. But this is really... Pi- that is the only thing I care about is the fact that they're going to be shown... Like, I can happily say, do you know what I mean? With full chest that I sat and slagged off creators on my fucking Discord. I don't care. I do it on my platform now. Do you know what I mean? Like, I that I don't care about. Go and leak whatever you want. Oh, Courtney said this about Angie. Courtney said this about Ms. Red. Like, um, do you know what I mean? Like, but... When it comes to people's personal stuff, that's when it's different. I'd hope, right, that they are not that bad of people, um, that they wouldn't do that. But, you know, all I can say is, remember, if you're not happy with something that's happening, you know what you can do. Um, Because no one's story should ever be getting literally bad. It happened in his group chat. You know, trust me, he'd, 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 he had a lot to say about certain people on this app. He had a lot to say. And family weren't protected. That's all I'm going to say as well. Ah, girl, to be honest, I don't care about our thing anymore. No bad feelings from my side here. Same. Did you regret it in, in past? regret what sorry i don't know to be honest i blocked her on everything yeah i mean to be honest when everything that's happened right you know majority of the people are well aware everyone knows the discord situation fucking hell um yeah and as i said um i believe that slander is a way to happen i believe lies are going to get said and that's all going to get screen recorded as evidence um slander is against the law did you know that slandering someone making out that they're a predator which they're going to try and do is against the law um propositioning a man in hospital that's what was said um yeah no jody 100 percent. i'm i'm honestly i'm done like i genuinely don't want to have like sit and have drama with people i want to be able to sit on this app and just speak about what's happening on the fyp do i get overly opinionated and passionate yeah because i can't help it how much they're going to try and paint me today that i'm not someone who cares about the lgbt like i'm not like against racism and stuff that is not even true i'm a hundred percent against everything like, I'm against anything where an individual's being hurt. 
people can sit on this app and attack me galore and say whatever they want about me right um at 10 o'clock on his account i'm even promoting it um i'd remember you in the debates if they share unsolved people's personal stories however then finish him well miss baguette as i said everything's going to be recorded Yeah, he's doing a live at 10 o'clock. What's the app, please? Mother Teresa, are you going to get and join in? Are you going to get in the box and expose me as well? <laughs> that Courtney once said something. Honestly, <laughs> we'll have all the exposures. Oh, Miss Begat! That was... <laughs> Guys... You all know in the chat. What will he gain? He wants to destroy me. That's what I was told today on the phone call. He's going to destroy me. Who's in my box? Oh. Hey. Hey, Cop. How are you? Oh, I'm good. You okay? Yeah. We're surviving. Yeah, I do realise Common Cafe is an open forum, but you do realise that I'm a tiny creator on here and you're still talking about me like utter weirdos. Oh, I don't want to do because the thing is, like, do you know, I'm not going to lie. Like, you, I know if you have personal beef with them, I don't. Cause to I me, don't have any beef with them, but they're talking about me. <laughs> yeah, it's just because I'm not going to lie. See, for Stop the last. Stop fucking talking about me, you absolute. Right. Freaks. Hayley, I'm like I'm not wanting to be rude to your end like that, right? But I just don't want to bring that here. Like there's enough going on. Like, and the thing is, I I'm not gonna lie, but a lot of the people on that that forum, maybe it'll change tomorrow or whatever, but have really been helpful and have actually really fucking supported me. I don't want to sit and have a bash in, like, um, do you know what I mean? Like, uh, generally, I've been able to sit on that forum and have conversations with people who generally try to help me and stuff. So I don't want to. Do you know what I mean? So, um, thank you guys. Thank you for the heart maze. Um, oh, do you know what I'm obsessed with? Red, red wine. I'm obsessed with their bacon and omelette rolls. Oh. Right, if he's not had a Greg's bacon and omelette roll. Uh, wait, you have the same accent as me. Where are you from, MKT? The only issue I have with Greg's, and I'm gonna say it, is the fact that sometimes their food's a little bit cold. And I know I could probably get it heated up, but I'm too fucking lazy for it. If I go and get food somewhere, fast food, I want it hot. <laughs> yeah, I am from there. Thank you so much. Um. Oh yeah, I was meant to switch that off. I don't know how to switch them off. Right guys, I'm gonna have to go because my kebab's gonna be fucking freezing. That was really Scottish of me there, wasn't it? <laughs> why is it not going away they're not going away i can't get them off but we've got the request off but anyway guys enjoy my exposure um oh it's just it's jody it's it's trying to get at me in any way like do you know they tried the the they tried to blackmail me yesterday and tell me that Luke, Miss Reds, and Pearl are going to expose me on a live if I don't make a video apologising. And then I went and spoke to them and it was all a fucking lie. Do you know what I mean? Like, um, we his doing it. So. <laughs> back him 
Um, I just don't get it. It's all it's so petty, Jody. Honestly, at this point, it really is. But anyway, enjoy the rest of your evening, guys. And um, as I said, I don't know when I'll be back, but I will, you know, post a video and stuff once a uh, thing because I can't obviously speak too much. Um. Okay, nobody said I just said it. I'll have a look at that. Thank you. No worries, guys. And I'm so sorry again for everyone that was in my Discord. You know, I do a fucking apologize. Um, no worries, Jodie. Honestly, to everyone that was in my Discord, I do apologize in advance. You know, and I'm so sorry that all the shit is fucking happening again. Do you know what I mean? But yeah, right. Enjoy the weekend, guys. Bye. The Observer providing you with the latest TikTok drama from across the UK.